these two units are standard DGST. You need a big gap in between to install fittings and sensors. With DADG axial piping, the supply air can be diverted to the back of the unit, enable you to assemble several units in a closer distance, giving a more compact machine build-up. The SLT has the supply port from the back and also form the side. Since DADG axial piping kit allow you to connect air supply from the back of DGST, it help in conversion of SLT to DGST simply because customers would like to have same manner of air supply. A seamless conversion of SLT to DGST. Now, let's look at the DGST mirror type. The DGST standard cylinders are installed in such a way for clamping purpose, you noticed over here the fittings are not installed at the same side. One at the bottom, another one at the top. As well for the sensors, you can see one will be installed at the top, another one will be installed at the bottom of another unit. DGST standard work well in that case. But with DGST L mirror type, the system will look more presentable and symmetrical with tubing installed at one side and sensor will be installed at another side. With that I hope you are able to understand Festo DGST features better. Thanks for watching.